Ever wanted to give rowing a try? Today we're here at Equinox Marina Del Rey with world champion rower and elite endurance athlete, Josh Crosby, here to show us how it's done. So Josh, why rowing? Why is it such a great workout? Rowing is an amazing sport because it uses over nine major muscle groups every stroke. Wow. Also, it's rather low impact, so you can work really high intensities or go for distance without feeling so beat up after you're done. Yeah, not a lot of impact yeah. on the body that way. So Josh, how do we get started? How do we set ourselves up here? That's the beauty of the machine too, is it's really simple to get going. Cool. What you want to do is you want to first adjust your foot stretchers. Okay. And so you want to move these things up and down. All and right. you'll see there's a bunch of holes. If you have shorter, cute feet like yours, my feet are little. you're going to want to lift them okay. so that you have maybe five or six holes showing. All right. I'm going to have four holes showing. I'm going to put my foot underneath there, and then I'm just going to snug this up. down. Yeah, it doesn't need to be too tight. So it kind of comes right over the shoelaces yeah. here? Yeah, all about going over the ball of your foot the right ball here. Of the foot. Yeah, okay. Not the toes, not the heel. Perfect. Now, next thing you're going to do is you're going to hit the center button on your monitor. That's gonna turn on your screen so that you have all your info to look at. Okay. And then you're gonna grab the handle with a nice loose grip and you're gonna be ready to go. Yeah. All right. Easy. Here's the deal. There's three things you need to know. Order, power, and timing. So let's go through the order first. Order. If you just move with me, you're gonna push your legs down first. You're gonna lean back second. Then you're gonna pull in with the handle right to the chest. Okay. Now, on the return, it's the exact opposite. Arms come out, body comes forward, legs come up. And we're just gonna move back and forth in that order. So just think, legs, core, arms, arms, core, legs. Legs, ah. core, arms, arms, core, legs. Let's get into the power. 60% of the power comes from your legs. A lot of times people think rowing's all about the upper body. Right. It's actually more about the lower body. So you're gonna push with the legs, really driving those Slow. legs down. And when the legs are almost all the way down, then you bring in 20% of the power from the core and finish it off with 20% of the power from the arms. I like that. So you really do get the legs to do a lot of that yeah. initial burst. That's right. And that just really gets the cardio going too. I feel it in the core as well, a lot. Yeah. And then that little final touch. It's one out, two count in. So power phase is a count of one and the recovery phase is a count of two. So it's like this, one, two, Three. One, two, three. I've been too nice to you so far. It's time to bring the intensity. Okay. So how do you do that? The beauty is with this Water Rower GX is you push and pull harder, just like you would in a boat. So okay. give me a little more push and pull to bring that intensity up. Think about jumping to the back wall. Oh, my numbers are going up too. <laughs> Good. Give me a little more jump and a little more speed, but we still keep that count. One, two, Three. Oh yeah, that makes a huge difference. Now give me five like we're racing to the finish line. Go. One. World champion. I two. See, I did no match. That's it, one more on this one. And there you go. Wow. That's incredible. I feel the cardio. My legs are burning more <laughs> than my back, but my core is so engaged. That was awesome. Well, you're a quick learner. And Thank you for letting me take you down the river. Thank you, Josh and Equinox Marina Del Rey for showing us how to use these great rowers. You were a lot of fun and you just gotta keep on rowing. Nice. We'll see you guys next time on Pop Sugar Fitness.